Which is brought to you by the computer guys and textbook guys in Canton and Potsdam. You know, you go to McDonald's and the drive through and it's backed up or Tim Hortons, whatever. Yep. And it just drives you crazy. It does but drive you crazy. But you have to control your it's anger. crazy! Come on! Dude, hurry up! Just get the food! That's what happened to this guy. George's yeah. 48-year-old Scott Buimi. Yeah. That's right. He became impatient. That's a long wait there in the uh, drive through line. Yeah. But unlike many of us, Scott got out of his car and confronted the man in front of him. Because like it was it's his, his fault. fault. It's his fault. Using expletives like beep and also beep. Uh -huh. And he had a gun. Lunged yeah. into the vehicle. And hey! A hey! <laughs> Imagine that. Give that cheeseburger. Hungry. What do you mean? What do you mean you don't want pickles? Do you know how long that takes? <laughs> listen, listen, Scott. Yep. Listen, Scott. Here, have the Snickers bar. <laughs> <laughs> you turn into <laughs> such a diva. You know? <laughs> so, well, unfortunately for Scott, it was called captured yeah. on surve surveillance cameras. Now, police yeah. arrived, discovered he was. DeKalb County Police Detective Scott Buimi. That's uh, right. Driving an unmarked police car, wearing a badge on his belt. Uh -huh. Which you think, just uh -huh. using the badge alone, put the gun away and be like, excuse me, sir, this is official police business. Uh, I need to ask you to pull over. And then Stupid. do that, and then cut in line. There you go. All right, here's another dumb thing. If you're ever uh, at a major airport and you have a sandwich called The Bomb... Don't make reference to it to TSA. That's stupid. Jason Cruz was about to abort his flight from New York's JFK International to L.A. Uh -huh. Knowing that it was a long flight, Cruz went to a local deli and grabbed a sandwich for the trip because, you know, you get hungry. Uh -huh. Now, unfortunately, Jason ordered a sandwich known as the bomb. Right. Now, as he's passing through airport security, Jason turned to his friend and said he wanted to bring the bomb uh -huh. aboard the plane. You can't say that Really? Anymore. Call it a sandwich. Now, TSA agents overheard the conversation, pulled the guys aside for an extended chat, of course. Luckily, no rubber gloves involved. We don't sure. I mean, it doesn't say that. But by the time the officers were satisfied that the bomb in question was, of course, the sandwich, they missed the flight and probably Just had to. keep your mouth shut. Take the bus.